All right, quick little uh, instructional video on how to play Last Child by Aerosmith. What we're doing is we're taking the root A minor and we're jumping it up here to the seventh fret. And I believe this was originally played on a banjo or written on a banjo. It was something to do with a banjo, how this originally came to be, how this riff came to be. So anyway, taking the A minor root chord, moving it up seventh fret here and uh, the open E drones, so it's just picking through that. And we switch to kind of, I don't know what this chord pattern is called, but again the open E is, is droning. So your first finger is on 4th fret, or 5th fret, 4th string, 7th uh, fret, 3rd string, and 8th uh, fret, B string and the E is also open. And then this one goes kind of an inverted chord, so it goes up to the ninth fret on the fourth string, the seventh fret on the G string, and the ninth fret on the B string, and the E is open again, droning. Just hold that position and slide it up three frets. Oops. Kind of funky and uh, it takes you a little bit to get into the pattern of how you're doing. You're hitting the open E and then uh, striking the uh, seventh fret on the E and the B strings on the seventh fret. So it's kind of a just a muted crunch. Very, very quick. It's a timing thing. So then you're playing uh, fourth fret. And they have A string, and then this, like. And then up to the seventh fret. Understanding is this was played by two different guitars. I just learned how to play it with one guitar. I think the uh, Joe Perry was playing, and then Brad Ridgeworth goes. But I just combined them, and it's like. to the bridge, the yes sir, no sir, don't come closer, and it's, uh, your A string is going to be droning, and you're going to be playing uh, kind of a, like that. sing and play. I shouldn't even try. Can't sing anyway. And then it comes to the uh, the chorus. It's on your fourth string. And this, these two notes play in the fifth string. Then you 
just lower that down to the fifth and sixth string. But then this goes, then down to the third. I had a couple crunches in there and a little slide just to for emphasis. So I hope that helps. That uh, I think that is everything in the song. Thank you.